Let's see what we're gonna get today. It looks like the new rage is this lettuce burger. He wants the plant-based burger. This is a cream cheese teriyaki. And that's just regular. I'll have this drink. Small? Small, small. And then I'll have onion rings with mine and I guess you'll get fries. Let's do it. Have you ever reclined in a chair with your eyes closed as in sleep and pictured a stream of water so real you could put your mental hands in it and they are wet? When you cupped your hands and brought them to your mouth, could you feel the water going down your throat? If you have, you know that the state you have entered is very real and personal. That is the power which is in store for you. That is your power tomorrow, when everything will be at your disposal, all based upon your own wonderful human imagination. For that is God. From Neville Goddard's 1969 lecture, Biblical Language. Some of us feel we don't know how to imagine, but we do. Every day, all throughout the day, we fall in and out of usually unintentional daydreams. And when we go to sleep, many remember their night dreams, where they're in a world as real as this world, not even realizing they're dreaming in their night dreams. So we all have the capacity to do it from one degree to another. We just have to do it intentionally and to practice. <laughs> Oh god, look at this teriyaki burger with cream cheese, right? And we got fries. What's the matter, darling? And you got a, a vegetarian burger made of soy. And we got onion rings and matcha kind of shakes and complimentary water. Yay! That is very matcha. Mm. It's quite exquisite. Let's see this burger. Is it like the impossible burger? I'm just gonna take a little bite. Maybe I'll become a vegan. Um, I have really no impression. You can try it by the way. Okay. Mm. Yours needs a lot of sauce to have some flavor. Oh, I love this technology of Japanese condiments. Mm. That's a good fry. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, what was I thinking wanting to go to McDonald's? I wasn't, I guess. I saw the dessert, new dessert commercial on TV, that's what happened. Let's see if you can become a vegan. What do you think? Mm. Not bad. Not bad? Mm. Alright, I'm gonna try mine. I got the teriyaki burger. Mine is meat, but with cream cheese. Mm -hmm. mm, better than yours. The teriyaki is very strong though, a little sugary, salty. I must say that the combination of the burger, teriyaki sauce, and the cream cheese, and the lettuce, crispy lettuce is, oh, and the sumptuous soft bread, it's just magnificent. As this melts down, it becomes even more wondrous. Matcha is usually pretty bitter, mm -hmm. but mixed with this soft serve oh, cream, yeah. it's just perfect. That is Guinea Chizu Teriyaki Baga. And what's this word say? The kanji? Kikan Gente. Kikan Gente. Kikan means term and Gente means limitation. Limitation, so it's 
temporary item. Well, so what it means basically is they had this burger before and then it was off the menu and now it's back. We don't quite word it like that. We might say a seasonal item. I thought you finally stopped wearing that shirt. Then I realized it's underneath. Uh -huh. You tricked me. I told you to stop wearing that shirt. <laughs> Dog. Just kidding. You can wear it if you want. You can wear it every day for a year if you want or more. Uh, yeah. Two, two days. It's not really cold. Honey, I want to buy you some new clothing. You don't want no, it? No, not now. Not now? Okay. What's this store called? Encho. Encho. And Jumbo Encho. Jumbo Encho. And it's a... What kind of store is it? A household? House. They sell rain boots? The garden. I can't believe it. Um, Miss Q. Carpenter. I, carpenter. I, I, I can't believe it. You're going to have a... We're going to have a rainy season. Be in Be May. DIY. Oh, because. how nice. Neville says, try ruling as God, knowing that all things are possible to your imagination. Imagine something that your reason and senses deny, and see if it works. If it does, then did you not rule the world as God? That's how God acts. He imagines and lets it appear. And who is he? The Ancient of Days. It sounds so easy, but many people don't know about this, or they don't actually test it, let alone persist. Part of it is developing the imaginal faculties, like any skill, with practice. And the second part is letting it appear, surrendering. Often we have some sort of resistance, unintentional, perhaps even subconscious. Thus it delays, prevents our imagining from outpicturing. This is why Neville tells you to persist, keep practicing. And for some it may be beneficial, along with imagining for the things that are so close to your heart but feel so big and far. Also add some things that feel more smaller and easier, but would be just for fun, a joy to imagine. So if you're not finding your results right away with things you consider big, you can also find the joy of celebrating small successes. Keep the faith and not get frustrated or burnt out. Oh my God, I found oh, this. Dickers, dickers. I found the same one from Amazon here. Dickers. Is that a good brand? Oh, it's interesting. What's it called, Dick? Dickers. Dickies. Dickies. Is that how you pronounce it your way? Honey, is this what size? I need 23, I'm 6.5 American, so maybe 23 Japanese? The Japanese version, I, I mean, Amazon Japan version, they said this is good on ice and snow, not that you get that much in Fuji. We could go to Hokkaido in these. In closing, Neville also tells a story of a man who celebrated his 100th birthday. When asked what the secret to his longevity was, he said, Smoking. I've been smoking every day of my life since I was eight years old. And then there is another lady who died at the age of 30. Reporters had said she never touched a cigarette in her life. Neville's mother never drank or smoke, but she died a painful death at 62. Neville said his father drank like a fish and broke every health code. He ate and drank whatever he wanted whenever he wanted. He died at 85 from sheer exhaustion. Having these examples, Neville says, I don't believe in this nonsense relative to what I should eat and drink. I will wear out this body just as I have a suit of clothes. And when I do, men will call me dead. But I will not be dead. I will be one with the awakened Christ. For I have experienced scripture. David, in the spirit, called me father. So now I know my name and will return to that awareness. And isn't that so? I remember when one of my father's staff members lived a very healthy life, eating clean, jogging, but then he dropped dead at an early age. I think it was a congenital heart defect he hadn't known about. And then there's someone like my father, who's a couch potato and eats whatever he wants. And in his mid-80s, he's still ticking, going off to all sorts of restaurants and malls. Of course, there are many examples of people living a healthy lifestyle feeling that that will keep them looking, feeling, and being good, and at doing so. And of course, examples are the opposite. But what Neville's telling you is to go deeper, to the true cause of all of life, the imagination. On the surface, it may seem there's a certain effect for certain causes in Caesar's world, 
But throughout history, there's so many examples that defy such, especially when people learn to use the power of their mind, who've cured the incurable, who can see when doctors said they shouldn't be able to see, and so forth. So right now, live whatever way feels best to you, but don't put all the power in that. Come to test out and to develop the imaginal muscle until you can transcend all and do whatever you please. So what's this firm? What's this mean? What word is that? Moment. Huh? Moment means, uh, yeah, pa, pa. Moment? Yeah. Good, yes. <laughs> I don't know how okay, to Okay, okay. And what's this? Soft? Genus. Uh, silk, Genus? Silk, silk. Silk, soft. And now, let us go into the silence. Good. Beautiful Japanese life over there. Toshi, I'd like a house like this. Mm. With flowers. A ah, little bit old house. I don't mind. We'll get a modern version. Nice, peaceful life. She's a garden. In a garden. 